I was LKY back in the day, this Cheng Hui Hui thing and this, what's his name, Tan Chuan Jin thing, would have been nipped in the bud right after their first session with each other. I mean, I would have sat them down and told them, you either get the F out of Parliament House and not treat it like Hotel 81, or I'm going to fire both of you and make sure everybody knows what you're up to. <laughs> but of course they were like, never discovered for a long time until evidence was gathered against the other two. And then the whole the whole place is tainted. It's tainted. I'm, I'm surprised there was no uh, motion of no confidence. Really, I'm surprised no one said anything and everybody's like hey, 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 which makes me think that everybody someone else is doing something everybody else may be doing something everybody is like in some kind of sonambula you know this like sleepwalking phase where hey it's so easy to earn this million dollar you know <laughs> public service job we just turn up and listen to people talk if they want to talk and ask questions and that's it, and that, that's our job, and it's okay. And sometimes people will say silly things like Amy Kaur telling Singaporeans, I'm not born here, but you know, if you don't like it, you can leave. Hey, witch, why don't you leave? You have the cushy job, right? A, a, a job that even your country would, would not even give you over here. So how about being nicer to us and saying, that's really rude, you know, what you just said? How about being nicer to us and saying, I'm really sorry, I didn't really mean to, to say that. Because what you said was, don't complain, leave if you're going to complain. And guess what? As a politician, you're supposed to hear people's complaints 24-7. Only you've had an easy job until now. That's right, you have. You've had a very easy job earning one million dollars, telling people if you're not happy, you can leave. When actual, in actual fact, we should be telling you, STFU, you should leave because you're not even treating your job properly. You should be treating us with some respect and listening to our concerns and doing something about it instead of saying if you don't like it here leave this is a public job this is not a private job you don't own this country like you would own a company but everybody seems to be treating it like it's a company no singapore is not singapore inc it's republic of singapore there's a difference private and public there's a difference so you argue for having a pay that is commensurate with uh you know or on par with uh, private sector, but what you don't get is that in the private sector, if they don't perform, the shareholders can tell them to get lost. Yeah, it's not you telling the people get lost. It's the shareholders who own the company who say to the director, look, you're not turning over a profit. Something is wrong. You've had two years to prove yourself. Now get lost. We'll pay you. We'll pay you even a little golden parachute. Okay, but you get lost. 